Hey guys, it's Kelly. We're doing reading your comments today. Wearing my dirty shirt. Um, I just want to say happy anniversary to Psycho Dad and Terry. You guys know them, they're Jesse's parents. Um, it's their anniversary today. I saw on Ashley's page because she, um, because little Terry on her Twitter wrote, um, happy anniversary to Psycho Dad and she responded, so that's how I saw it. But, anyways, that's funny. Their anniversary this month and and October 24th is my parents anniversary so it's kind of crazy but anyways um so yeah happy anniversary you guys have a good one but here we go Dylan Vincent and Kelly good job on prank on your sister I don't know why I turn this off just you guys can hear me um thank you appreciate your support thank you guys for all of you who have subscribed to my channel at 524 subscribers which is great I'm so excited to continue to grow um Dylan Vincent you did a good job on the prank. Oh no, sorry. That was repeat, my bad. Um, fan1234. Love the video. Just, just like the video. Thanks, appreciate your support. Fan1234. Stop the hate, Savannah. Thing. Yeah, after that last week in comments video, she did do this real comment with just random letters, and then she ended up deleting it. So, but I haven't heard from her since, so I don't know, maybe she just... You know, after what my sister said in the last video in your comments. If you haven't seen the last video in your comments, check it out. My sister was in it. But anyways, um, so maybe after what my sister was saying to her, you know, she just learned, you know. Anyways, um, fan1234, like your profile picture. It's a Minecraft. Love Minecraft. It's one of my favorite games, so, yeah. Hey. Um, Dylan Vincent. Hey, Kelly, you look pretty on your video. You look pretty. Thank you. Colin, beautiful you too, as always. Thank you, Colin. Fan1234, love the video. Thank you. Appreciate your support. Dylan Vincent, hi, Kelly. Love to video, too. I love the video, too. Be safe, okay? Thanks. Um, Glory Glenn, you are... I love you. I'm sorry. Okay. Love you, too, Glory. Colin, put five heart emojis. Thanks, Colin. Dylan Vincent, hi, Kelly. Love the video. I'm sorry you're a good friend to your sister. She's a good friend to you. Thanks. Dylan Vincent, hey Kelly, I love the YouTube video. Good job on the YouTube video. Good job on the YouTube channel. Thank you. Appreciate your support. Colin, very interesting old fashioned items. Gotta love the antiques. Yeah. Although, I'm kind of weird with the antiques because, as you guys know, I'm into the paranormal. And I've heard so many stories about antiques, things like being haunted. Like, look at the Annabelle doll. You know, like there's just so many things, like antique type things. Like, just, So, I don't really mess with the antiques too much. You know, so. Um, and if you want to try, I always say I'm um, thanks for the support a lot. It's because I don't know what else to say. It's like, you know what I mean? So I just say that because I, I don't know. Anyways, Caleb Caustic, some of it must be staged. I mean, I assume where he's referring to the whole, um, when McDragon gets my waffle pole in that video from like a week ago. Yeah, I mean, I feel like some of it was real. You know, I feel like that's the thing with Jesse's videos. Like, you guys always want to say they're fake. And yes, I feel though some of his videos, like, some of it's faked. But I feel like also some of it's real. And let's not use the word fake. Let's use series. I don't know I'm saying fake. Um, but, you know, scripted. You know, that's the thing. I feel like a lot of times with Jesse, he exaggerates things. So, like, I don't feel like it's completely not real or scripted. But it's not completely real either. But it's not completely scripted, if that makes sense. You know what I mean? Anyways, um, Alex Clausen, tell Jesse he is fake. I actually dislike this comment. I usually don't dislike comments, just I have already probably, because it's probably like the third comment ever I've ever disliked. Um, but it's because, why do you have to be mean, bro? Like, if you don't like Jesse, then don't fucking watch him. Like, it's that simple. Like, why do you have to be mean? Tell Jesse he's fake. You know, if you don't like his videos, then don't fucking watch him. Like, seriously, why do you have to be mean? Like, what does that achieve? You know, what does that do by you putting this comment about Jesse being mean, being a hater? What does this achieve? What does this do? Does this change anything? No. If you don't like someone, instead of hating on them, you leave a mean comment, just don't watch them. There's plenty of other YouTubers you can watch, plenty of other YouTube videos you can watch. Go watch them. Asshole. Jim. Sorry, guys, I don't mean to get oh, aggressive. They're just pissing me off because there's no reason to hate on people. Like, if you don't like a person, you don't like their content or whatever, then don't watch them. Like, it's that fucking simple. I can't, I don't know. Jim Greenstein, there's a new video that just came out with MJN on Raffle Pwn's channel. I did see it. I did kind of wish I reacted to it because he did say some great things that I agreed with. Not just the, um, Brandon. No, why do I keep calling him Brandon? Steven. 
it's Steven, the one that freaks out in the Waffle Pwn videos. I don't know why I keep wanting to call him Brandon. Um, it's weird though, Jesse said Jack's a key one, and Brandon's an autistic one. Which, I feel like it's the other way around. I mean, obviously not autistic, but I think, I, did I say Brandon and Steven is a key one? Um, but I think Steven is the key one. Jack's okay, but, I don't know. Anyways. What's up in pro wrestling? Cool video. Thank you. And I actually do like wrestling. So, cool name. I mean, I don't really watch it much on TV. I mostly watch it on YouTube when I do watch it. But, yeah. What's up pro wrestling? Put Savi. Oh, thank you. Appreciate it. Take a few for a second. What's up in pro wrestling? Put cool video. Thank you for your support. Garbo the verse v v s put the whole idea is that while me juggling like to the psycho there was being scripted and all the waffle home thing as well and his brother Jack like Michael Green instigates his family member to act this way because even when I'd first read waffle waffle porn, I just felt in my heart the stuff they did was real stuff that family is messed up for instigating their family member like that oh and the boogie oh and boogie doesn't always script his shit either. I think the only thing Boogie scripts is the Francis stuff when he does that. Um, and Michael's stuff, I believe, was real. Right, angry rapper. Well, I'm not 100% sure, but I kind of believe that was real. Because think about it. You really, I don't know. Just like when they started out, they, like, they started out living in a trailer. You know? Like, so they obviously didn't have enough money. You think they really had enough money to be able to for new things when AGP breaks down, like, especially in the beginning when the channel first started years and years ago. You know, even about 10 years ago, you know, when they were still, you know, AGP was still living in the trailer park, like, they might have been making good money on YouTube, but I don't see why they were faking. You know? Like, I love Angry Grandpa. I thought the videos were entertaining to watch, were fun to watch. Especially, I liked the um, paranormal videos Michael did when he was Ghost Hunt and stuff. I do miss AGP, he was a cool dude, but I don't think Michael's stuff was ever really scripted, honestly. I'm not 100% sure. I mean, I don't even know how I feel on that whole thing. But and I don't know about the whole Waffle Pwn thing. I never really watched them. I know that one freak out video with the kid, that guy, you know, when he um, got his account deleted on the, the game, and he was freaking out in the bedroom, like, tore over sheets, like, was trying to put the remote up his butt. Like, I remember that video, because that was a popular video. I've seen that, but... So I don't know about Waffle Pwn. What do you guys think? you guys think AGP's videos were real? The freakouts? Do you guys think Waffle Pwns were real? I don't know. I feel like, oh, like even with Jesse's stuff, I feel like everything has some sort of realism to it, if it makes, if that makes sense. Anyway, still in Vincent put, Hey Kelly, love the YouTube video. You're making good job on your YouTube channel. Good job. You're a good friend. I love the YouTube channel. The one you make, I love the YouTube videos you did. Good job. Thanks. And... Fan1234 responded to that comment saying hi, and then he also said, I love the video. Thanks for your support. Next, Vextron put Danbury film, mall fireworks, right? And, and then I responded, put no Dolby shell, and then he said, oh, lol, my mistake. So I assume you live in Connecticut, since you know about, you know, Danbury and all that. Never heard of the Danbury film, mall fireworks. Well, I know Danbury mall, but... You know, to get fireworks. So it's cool to see a fellow Connecticut here. So it's cool, bro. Dylan Vincent, good job on the YouTube video. Good job. I like the YouTube video. Love the YouTube video. Good job. Good job, Kelly. You did good job. Thank you. Thank you. Good job. I love it. You look so pretty. You are a good friend. Thank you. Thank you. Love your video. Thanks. Dylan Vincent, good job on the YouTube video. Oh no. So it's the same one. Nolan Jeffrey Denny put the back. Man Gamer fan versus McJuggerdickets. Okay. I don't know who the Batman Gamer is. And then he put Caleb Crossing. We all know Jesse is deck chair. It's just a series. I mean, you can't really assume that. Because we don't know for sure. It is possible, but remember that. I don't know if you ever heard the saying, but the saying goes, you know, wait. What happens when you assume things, people? You make an ass of you and me. So don't assume things. Like, obviously, you know, I feel like something's up with the whole deck tier thing because it is Jesse and he's always, you know, has some sort of, always has something up his sleeve. So I don't know if it's Jesse or maybe someone he knows, you know, but who knows. So, 
But anyways, um, Dylan Vincent put Solid Killing Crying. I love the video. I'm crying right now. You put a bunch of the crying emojis. You crying sad tears or happy tears? Nolan Jeffrey Denny put the Batman game. Oh no, he put the. Oh no, I read red. I just. Oh no, never mind. The Batman Gamer. Oh, Nolan Jeffrey Denny. The Batman Gamer of Ram versus Casey Sarandon. Again, I don't know who that is. If you want to clarify for me who that is in the comments, never heard of him. I'm assuming it's another YouTuber. Um, and the last comment is from Caleb Caustic. I hope Jesse uploads again. Me too, because the last week when he uploaded the last video, when he met Waffle Pone, he said regular content returns, but he doesn't upload anything. But again, that Twitter video he did that I made a video about yesterday, he was staying in his Tesla, so him and Ashley are still traveling, but they should be home soon, because they said two months they were going on this road trip, and it's almost two months. Like, I think another week would be, like, two months, so... Who knows? I guess we just have to wait and see. But, yeah. Hope you guys enjoyed that reading your comments. Let me know what you guys think in comments. Please continue to comment, guys. I appreciate all your comments. I love reading the comments. I love knowing your guys' opinion on things. So, please let me know your opinion about what I was saying about Storyfire from yesterday's video. That would be greatly appreciated. Please follow me on all my socials. Follow Colin and Insta. Subscribe to Josh. Subscribe to Juggy Ghost. Subscribe to Always Underscore Juggy. Subscribe to Dan. Subscribe to Jacob. Subscribe to Colin. Guys, please subscribe to me. Please like and please comment. Because I do really love doing YouTube. It's really an awesome thing. And again, happy anniversary to Psycho Dad and Terry. You guys have a great one. Um, and please, guys, I do need video ideas. Because I never know what to film. You know, it's hard to try and come up with ideas. So if you have ideas, let me know. I may be going to an amusement park this Saturday. I most likely am, so if I do it, maybe I can film some stuff for that. If that's something you guys want to see, let me know. But I love you guys so much, my randomers. <laughs> Jesus. Just talk to my saliva. And now we see Oh, make sure you follow my Majogo Nuggets fan page. It's MJN underscore for EVA. Oh, no, it's MJN underscore, yeah, fan. Then the number four and then EVA. Although, okay, so make sure you follow that. I have two other instances, too, you can follow and please follow me on my TikTok because I've been trying to grow that. And I've been posting TikToks in there. So check that out. And I will see you randomers in the next video. Peace.